Yeah, so um, the Club Shay Shay was this week, and they had Offset. <sighs> he made he made the. I mean, I can't blame him for saying that. Oh, yeah. Him saying that Migos is the greatest group of all time. He said I can't. That? Yeah. Oh no. I can't. Did. I can't. I can't knock him for saying that because that's who's he with. No, but that's, that's who you're with. You know that. No. Even if I don't believe it. But uh, he know damn well. That's not acceptable from a fifty-five-year-old man. He's seen hip hop from the eighties. But you know damn well the Migos is not better than. Uh, you know I'm still mad that they rank Migos higher than Mob Deep. That still burns me. Yeah. Not yeah. to mention they rank them higher than UGK. Yeah. Rank them higher than um. Damn near any group you can brand Nubians any group you can think of they rank Migos higher than. Not saying Migos doesn't deserve credit for what they did. But well, they should have been in the bottom twenty. <sighs> They were higher than Onyx. Oh man, oh man, that would that, that 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 disappoints me greatly. They were they were higher than Black. I don't even think Rock and Rock made the list. Damn. But he also said that Shannon need to quit wearing them them tight ass clothes. All right, you gotta stop wearing them tight pants too. No, I can't do that. Yes, you you got to, bro. I'm, no, I'm trying to tell you like a player. I'm, I'm trying to tell you like a I player. ain't been letting them change me, man. It ain't about that, bro. It's just you big. And and shit, shit got a, he got more offended at that than being called gay. I mean, How but you it's gonna tell but me? it's it's the the fashion though. Unfortunately, no, everybody been telling Shannon from he said his sister told him that his clothes is too tight. And I mean, he set. could he could probably get his like fixed the way he want him. He does it like, but me and Buddha talk about fashion all the time and going out to shop and all your legs are tapered and stuff like that. Like, you know, that's just how they make these pants nowadays. Oh. And I hate it, but that's why y'all be shopping at them trendy motherfucking spots, nigga. Just go to just go to Amazon and get you some normal clothes. I just get I, you some 50 year old nigga clothes. With tapered Tapered pants are the worst thing that's ever happened to the men genre. Like I yeah, just band, hate banded them. bottoms. <laughs> banded bottoms. And oh, I just hate tapered pants. Like let them hang, bro. Like like let the let the thing hang. Yeah, but Shannon, um, he 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 shot back how he's not gonna listen to Offset, and he should wear the clothes he likes. Which I he did. I've heard you are opening yourself up to clown. Where would you want? I think he's trying too hard. Because it's like he's in the gym all the time and buff at 55, so he wants to show his body off all the time. When he jumped out that truck, what was it, two weeks ago, and yeah, they caught him in that green. picture? Yeah, and he was looking like that. If that wasn't enough right there to make you be like, whoa, okay. I'm, I'm I mean, that wouldn't have looked that way with a, with a loose hanging shirt. I'm going to do something different. I'm going to dress a little differently. If that didn't make you do then no, he Shannon ain't going to stop dressing. mad offended. How you going to tell me what to wear all shit? Yeah, so I I I think Shan yeah. Oh, I've been working on my Shannon shock. <laughs> I don't know. I'll be listening to Shannon all the time. But it's it's is that the old guy trying to be young thing? Sort of. Like is, I said, I think it's because he's in the gym. Where if he wasn't as in shape, he. But I Shannon's also think that's dude. doing too much. Cause yo, there was like. This girl I dated like a few years ago, and there was like this old nigga in the neighborhood a few like blocks up, and he would always be outside. He's in his 50s washing his car with his shirt off. You know what I'm saying? And to his credit, pause, he he, he was in shape. He was a decent looking 55, but it's like you trying too hard, dog. Every time he'd be outside with his shirt off. After a while, got you got the music blasting. Going. And I'm just like, yo, you know. What? I I say nothing, but your shirt is always off. But I ain't say yeah. nothing. I, 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 I was 272 at one point. Damn. Yeah. That's what I'm trying they to get to now. Well, shit. I knew I was skinny. They was like, you skinny, didn't they? Boot, like, everybody's skinny, though. Everybody I saw, my cousin Rated R done dropped some weight. He looking amazing, like, you know, that. Slim and trim. Oh, I'm losing weight, but damn, if that was your biggest. That's like part of my target goal weight, 272. Well, I don't think I've ever hit 270. Nothing on the scale. Nigga, you thin. You, you don't remember that green shirt with Weed Over Dad and shit? Like, I'm on one side, you on the other. Nigga, that's 272 right there. I was probably two, two, that's 272 on me right there. I was 225, 230. See that shit on the draw. I'm going to wear tighter clothes when I lose weight. 
But it ain't going to be Shannon Sharp type. Yeah. <laughs> you know what? We were big, but I was like 230, 235 in those pictures. You? Yeah. Man, if you. if we pull up these pictures and we look like we were lifting weights and shit the way we were standing over there. Yeah, <laughs> it's not like, like. No, nah, that's just large. Oh, just big wild. niggas. That's all. Like, we look like we've been lifting weights. Nah, I think we just fat. <laughs> big boys. Huskies. Mm-mm-mm. 